Well, hello friends. Welcome back to the car. It's a uh, comfortable minus one degrees outside tonight. And I just got out of the gym where I've been on a break for about a week due to a minor shoulder injury. So it's really good to be back and on track. And since we haven't done regular car talk for a while, I figured we could start with a bit of an update. So things are good. Everything's good with me, with uh, Serenity OS project. And if you've been following the channel, you know I've been on a bit of a security-related rabbit hole uh, expedition for the last two months um, because it's, I suppose it's a project tradition now that uh, uh, we get owned for Christmas and then I spend a month or two uh, improving system security. So that's been super fun and I've learned so much about security uh, mechanisms and I really feel proud of uh, the work that has gone into improving system security recently uh, and I'm really happy that so many people have been helping with that. Um, you know, whether you've been helping with um, adding mitigations or um, fixing bugs or um, adding fuzzing or fixing fuzzing bugs or if you were one of the people who broke into the system and found flaws that we could fix, uh, a whole lot of people have helped out with this and it's been super awesome to work with everybody to improve. And uh, I'm excited to see what happens next year. Like uh, if we can be in a CTF again and it would be, I, I'm, I'm just really curious to see what the next, uh, next way in will be. Uh, so, it's, it's, it's been really great working on security stuff, but at the same time, I'm starting to feel a little bit guilty that I'm not doing enough work on other stuff. Um, but at the same time, my main philosophy with my work on Serenity is always that um, me and everybody else should do the thing that they're the most interested in, right? So um, because of that, I've just pursued the security angle because it's been so much fun. Uh, but... I'm, I'm starting to think of a lot of other things that I want to do too. And uh, I did uh, some hacking on the profiler yesterday, which was really, really fun. And it was so, uh, so good to get some new features into it. And I almost felt like a little bit uh, rusty <laughs> when it came to like adding new features. Like, oh, forgot how to add a GUI to something. <laughs> but it was good to get back on that. Um, and, uh, yeah, so, so everything's been really fun with the security and, um, it was also really cool that we were featured on the live overflow channel, um, in multiple videos that was really, really fun. And it brought a, uh, whole bunch of people over to, to this channel, um, and, that's been really great too because um, those were most of those people were very interested in security, right? And uh, um, it's been really cool to have people, security-minded people, looking at the system. And it's like um, they just come at it from a different angle than um, the builder programmer types. And I find it fascinating. And I'm trying to learn to think in both ways and improve my skill from both angles. And I'm just uh, really happy to have so many security curious people around. Um, so welcome if you're one of those people who, who came to Serenity because of security uh, exposure or Live Overflow. Um, and thank you to Live Overflow, of course, for sharing the channel and sharing my work and our work and everything. Um, and what else? Something else that's that I really like lately is um, that there has been sort of um, some people working on visual stuff in the project, like uh, like Nick and uh, Thank You Very Cool, um, among many other people. And um, it's so cool when people get how to do like really good looking visual stuff in the system because um because serenity in my mind is like it is a very visual 
uh, concept. It's it's not just um, a command line operating system like so many operating systems, right? Um, it's it's a whole package, and uh, it's really really important that we make the GUI as good as it can be, right? Like as good as we can make it. And I love seeing these people with an eye for um, an eye for UI, an eye for uh, design, I for aesthetics. Uh, it's really fun to have people like that working on the system and just uh, improving stuff. Um, so I'm happy about that. And uh, but I'm still gonna <laughs> still gonna keep doing my um, my um, visual tweaks as well, of course. But um, I I ad must admit to myself that like I'm not as good at uh, drawing icons, for example, as uh, as someone like thank you very cool, which by the way thank you very cool is a it's like <laughs> it's a hilarious GitHub username <laughs> because I, I don't know I just love that name I don't know their real name so I only have thank you very cool to go by so thank you very cool very wait no no thank you thank you very cool very cool um, I like to say that. Anyway, um, some other stuff that I really like is that um, Itamar has been working a lot on Hack Studio and especially like building out the C++ parser uh, and adding various things related to that, like um, like jump to uh, declaration and um, most recently like find declaration, stuff like that. And I'm, I'm really excited to see what we can do with that um and i i really love that the project attracts these um these very like capable uh hackers who are are not afraid to try stuff that they've never done before and uh, because i i really think that that's this is such a good playground if you're that type of person um, and I've certainly learned a lot of things while working on this project, right? Like thousands of things. And, and I think that, um, I'm really happy that it can attract other people uh, who use it as a platform to learn things for themselves. Um, and of course I did the, um, developer interview with Linus, which was really fun. And... I'm um, trying to get more of those lined up. And um, uh, what else? I guess um, one thing that I sometimes I find it a bit hard to like choose where to put focus. Because um, in my mind, there are like these almost like these segregated focus areas now that there's like the security focus, the browser focus, and the desktop GUI focus. And I guess to an extent, like um, um, the development tools, like dev tools focus, like Hack Studio and Profiler and stuff like that. And I don't know why I segregate into these specific areas in my mind, um, but I find it sometimes a little bit hard to um, jump between these different areas even though I would really like to get better at that. So that's something I, I guess I'm, I'm trying to work on, just getting better at uh, switching things up. But, um, but it is okay. Um, <sighs> I don't know. I guess I just wanted to dump my thoughts a little bit and this was me doing that. Um, I'm running out of things to say now, so. <laughs> But it was good to do a little car talk warm up video. Would be good to uh, would be good to go inside now because it is a little bit cold. I have to admit. So thank you very much for hanging out with me in the car for a moment, and um, I'll see you soon. Bye.